On October 6th, the Deep Fat Fried live show and meetup is coming to Las Vegas, featuring TJ, Scotty, Paul's Ego, musical guest, The God Bombs. Get your tickets now, available in the description section down below. Be there or be dead. Or square. This guy. I just want to say something to you, Bethesda. Just want to I, I'm not really sure what this is all about. I guess um, this guy is mad that the, uh, the game Starfield that Bethesda just put out has uh, pronouns in it. And, uh, you know, <laughs> this is very upsetting stuff. And, you know, obviously very worthy of getting, like, you know, histrionic about. So let's see what's going on here. I'm going to say a little, little something. There is nothing I love more. Taking my headphones off. But yeah, f that. There is no you don't need that sh headphones. He's right. I don't need that. Sh Get that the f out of here. I don't need no headphones. Nothing I love more than to, to, to sit down. What is that creepy ass doll in the top right? Uh, don't judge his cum, his cum sock, dude. Come on. Comfy chair, turn on my PC, fire up a brand new RPG, uh, uh, lose myself, think, oh my God, just think of the- I mean, if I was you, I'd want to lose myself too. <laughs> I'd be like, God damn it. I got to get rid of me somehow. This RPG seems like a good solution as any. This world, just think of all the planets I can visit, all the immersive things that I can get involved with, all the fights, all the- Yeah, he does kind of look like Mini-Me all grown up. <laughs> you know, like, hey, Mini-Me, he turned out to be normal size after all. Good for you, buddy. The relationships, all the people I meet, all the places I go. I'm so excited to go there. And you know, I love nothing more than with all of that laid out in front of me, I love nothing more than to be dragged out at every f conceivable opportunity so you can f current day us. What happened? <laughs> did, did something happen? Why are you so mad all of a sudden, buddy? Holy sh Simmer down now. What? Did he just use current day as a verb? It's like a fine current day us. What does it mean to current day you? Does that, is he saying because the game contains pro town, pro towns? <laughs> Your amateur town, I'm a pro town. Because the game contains pronouns and you can select your pronouns because that option is available to you to choose. The game is current daying him. Well, isn't the game set in the future? How do you know pronouns won't be a thing in the future? How do you know that the pronoun sh won't even be way crazier in the future? Or maybe there will only be one set of completely gender ambiguous pronouns. Like you don't know what the future is gonna f hold. So how can you really claim something is current day in me? Cause it's the f future, right? If it was about the past, if it was like a game set in like 1690 and it was asking for preferred pronouns then maybe he'd kind of have a point. I mean, I still wouldn't give it because who really cares at all? But at least it would make some manner of logical sense. But the fact that the game is set in the future means that this doesn't even make any sense. Because how does he know that pronoun asking isn't still going to be a thing in whatever freaking far-flung future year Starfield is set in? He doesn't know that. Sorry, did you want to get immersed in our world? Yeah, well, guess what? F pronouns! <laughs> I'm sorry that ruined it for you. Maybe that's not the right world for you then, you know? You don't need, you don't need that f pronoun ass world. Get your money back. Tell Bethesda, you stand up to Bethesda. Tell them like, I don't even want this pronoun addled piece of shit. Get this out of here. Come back when you got a world without pronouns I can immerse myself in. I don't need all this pronoun sh following me around, dogging me at all times. It's like a nightmare. Everywhere I go, it's pronouns, pronouns. Oh, there's a pronoun. Oh, and there's a pronoun. Get away, get away, pronoun. Get out of here, 
you scare me. Please don't hurt me, pronoun. Please. Gender ambiguity. Current day Californian. Because that's all we fucking know. Because we're boring. We're so f boring. Yeah, well, guess what? <laughs> the solution to being so boring is not actually screaming at the top of your lungs about every little minor irritation that you have during the course of the day. Okay? Like, is this really worth this level of anger? I mean, it's not worth any anger at all, in my opinion, but even if this were to perturb me, is it really worth this? Like, and Taco Bell forgot my ruddy onions! Ah! <laughs> like, is it worth that? Is this really like a, a major situation? I'm going to remember this guy the next time I hear any of these, like, you know, pro men motherfuckers you got going around these days. Like, oh, we love men, men, men. Next time one of them is like, w men are better because women are too emotional. They just emotionally react to things. Not like us men, cool-headed and stoic. Next motherfucker that tells me that, I'm going to start remembering this guy screaming about pronouns in Starfield with a look of, like, pure disgust, hatred, anger, and sorrow burning in his beady little eyes. That's going to be what I think of next time people tell me about, like, the great rational emotionless cool as a cucumber man i'm gonna think of like pronouns in me starfield ruining the fucking immersion with their current day california bull and i'm so fucking upset right now i'm gonna fucking cry mate look at me Cry. All right there, buddy. Settle on the f down, my friend. Oh, oh, oh God. Does that dude's back, does that say baby face back there? Is this dude called baby face? <laughs> because if that's what a baby's face looks like, I found another argument against Matt Walsh's pro-child position. We can't see past our own reflection. That's the level of our narcissism here at Bethesda Western Game Company. Man. <sighs> Not since Martin Luther King had a dream, has a speech made by a human being resounded throughout the hearts and minds of those spanning across the vast gulf of history quite like this speech today i mean we you everyone here in my chat you should consider yourself blessed that you were here at this moment to hear these words finally spoken yes we cannot even see past our own reflection because that is the narcissism of Bethesda Western Game Company. I mean, really, who, who is it that can't see beyond their own reflection? If you are so triggered by the option to choose a pronoun, if you're so triggered by being given that choice, then really, who's afraid of their own reflection here? Who can't see past that? Sh I think it's the bald British man having a histrionic pissy fit about gender options in a video game. I think it might be that guy who's having a little trouble seeing past himself, bud. What do you think? your immersion you having a good time you falling into a world and just getting lost no 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 man they really stole something from this guy you know what i mean like that's the attitude isn't it like they really they took something away from him the fact that he logged into this game 
And he was like, man, I can't wait to go on a magical space adventure. And then it was like, please choose your pronouns. His day was ruined. His month, his year was ruined by that shit. How dare you mother that made this game, that put in all the development work to make this game and have been working on this game for years, that wrote the script for this game, did all the programming in this game, how dare you make even one decision that I don't like? How dare you? You're a narcissist. They're the narcissist here. They're the narcissist because you think that you should be able to control the content of their game. They are narcissists. They can't see past their own reflection. Woo. If you had self-awareness, you'd be dangerous, buddy. Current day. Cough. You're boring. You're dull. You have nothing to say. You are a one hived mind twat waffle. <laughs> this is the projection uh, segment of this video. <laughs> That's about all I can say about that. <clears throat> That's all you are. And you wonder why people are getting so sick and tired. You take everything we love, all our immersions, all our fantasies, all our escapism, and you just can't help shovel your dog f***ing crap ideology into everything, every single solitary f***ing thing. <laughs> Dude, this is this guy's reaction to turning on a game that he's probably been looking forward to for quite some time. And going to the character creator screen and seeing a little drop down menu that's like preferred pronouns. That drop down menu, or whatever form it took, is why the f this guy is screaming at the top of his lungs about how all of his immersion and fantasy was stolen away from him. Like this guy is unhinged. This dude's a nut. If you care that much about something like that, if you can be triggered to this level of rage and inept, and inept like impotent anger by the mere inclusion of a little drop menu that's like preferred pronouns, he, her, <laughs> he, her, she, her, he, him, they, them. I don't know if there was some Z, Zer in there, but I mean, whatever. Just like the, the very nature, like, okay, even if I was on this guy's side ideologically and I thought like, man, these pronouns are a bunch of horse fuck that garbage. Even if I was that guy and I booted up Starfield and I was like, I'm Tom for some Starfield. And I saw the little preferred pronoun thing. You know what my reaction would be as a guy that shares that this dude's beliefs? It'd have been like, pfft, bullshit. And then I would have moved on with my life. That would have been it. That would have been it. There would have been none of this There'd been none of this bullshit. God damn it, man, man, man. I can't believe they've done this to me. Why have they betrayed me? Why has Bethesda betrayed me? They've plunged a dagger of malice into my innocent young heart. They have destroyed the very concept of escapism. No! Cuckoo! 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 You're a nut, buddy. <laughs> You're a nut and you need to go get help. <laughs> aww aww poor fella he just wanted to enjoy some Starfield so uh, can we nuke Britain I mean I don't know if it's I mean I can't necessarily argue against it at this point right I can't necessarily say no